Now see, now second exercise is write the answer of each of the following question. Okay? Write the answer of each of the following question. First question is, what is the name of horizontal and vertical line drawn to determine the position of any point in a Cartesian plane? Answer of number one. Answer of first question. Horizontal line is called x-axis. Okay? And vertical line is called y-axis. This is answer of my first question. Second question is what is the name of each part of, of the plane formed by these two lines? Answer of second, I discuss kar diya. Each part is called quadrant. Each part is called quadrant. Okay? Okay? Third question is write the name of the point where these two lines intersect. The, the point where two lines intersect. The point where two lines intersect is called, bolo bolo, intersect is called origin. Okay? And whose coordinates are 0, 0. We have discussed kar diya hai. Kar diya hai na? So that is your Second exercise, okay? Now, second question of second exercise is, in figure 3.14, and write the following, the coordinates of point B. What is the coordinates? Look at this figure. What is the... See the following figure and write the following. The coordinates of point B. You see. Point B is in which quadrant? Tell me. Is in second quadrant. Clear? Now from point B, if I draw perpendicular on X axis, it intersect X axis at minus 5. And if I draw perpendicular from B on Y axis, it intersect Y axis at 2. So my X coordinate is minus 5 and Y coordinate is 2. So what are the coordinates of point B? The coordinates of point B are minus 5, 2. Right? What are the coordinates of point B? Minus 5, 2. Clear? So, I am looking at the answer. The coordinates of point B of point B are minus 5, 2. Clear? Distance of point B from y axis is 5 and x axis is 2 but it is in second quadrant so x coordinate is negative y coordinate is positive. Now second answer. The coordinates of point C. Now see where C lies. C lies in fourth quadrant and it is at a distance how many units from x axis? 5 units from x axis. And from y axis, how many unit? That is also 5. Clear? Yeah, 3, 4 and 5, yeah. So what are the coordinate of point C? 5 minus 5. Okay? 
the coordinates of point C are coordinates of point C are minus 5, minus 5. Minus 5, nay, plus 5, minus 5, okay? It is plus 5, minus 5. Because the x coordinate is positive and y coordinate is negative, okay? Now, the point identified by the coordinates minus 3, minus 5. Matlab, distance of this point from Pahle to x coordinate is negative, y coordinate is negative. So it is in third quadrant. So point whose coordinates are minus 3, minus 5 is in third quadrant. So you see in third quadrant there are two points. Right? D and E. Clear? Hamara minus 3, minus 5 wala D hai ki E hai. Wo decide karo. Minus 3 matlab the point whose distance from y axis is 3. Okay? And from x axis distance is 5. So it will be my point, I think, E, right? E is my, E is my required point. Dekho, E ka hai? Isme, a figure mein, B is in second quadrant, D is in first quadrant, H and E is in third quadrant, and G and C are in fourth quadrant, and M is on X axis. So you are given 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 points are given. Usme se do point ke coordinate humne nikal diye. And third question is, point identify by the coordinates minus 3, minus 5 is, E clear? The point identified by the coordinates minus 3 minus 5 is what is the point? Point is E clear? Now fourth question is the point where the coordinates are 2 minus 4. 2 minus 4 matlab this point x coordinate positive y coordinate negative. So it is always in a fourth quadrant. Fourth quadrant mein there are two points. Konse point hai fourth mein G and C. Ab ya to answer G hoga ya to C hoga. Clear? Clear? Ab dekho. Two is a distance of point from y axis. It intersect x coordinate at two. X axis at two. And y axis at minus four. So what are these? The point identified by the coordinates 2 minus 4 are D. Clear? The point is D. So what is the answer for uh, question number 4? Answer for question number 4 is uh, Answer for question number 4 is point G. Clear? Now fifth question. Fifth question is the abscissa of point D. What are the x coordinate of point D? x coordinate of point D is 6. The abscissa of point D is 6. Because D is on, D is in, in first quadrant. And distance from Y axis is 6. Also I can say, it intersect X axis that 6. So, FCS of point D is 6. Now, 6 question. The coordinates Ordinates of point H. The ordinate. Ordinate matlab y axis. Ordinate of point H. Now see. H is in second quadrant. Okay. 
एच इज इन दी सेकंड कोड देखो दिया खा आपने फिगर में एक्स एच देखो एक्स इज इन सेकंड कोड सो ऑर्डिनेट ऑफ एच इज इन थर्ड कोड सॉरी एच इज इन देखो फिगर में एच कहा है एच इज इन थर्ड कॉर्ड थर्ड कॉर्ड में बोथ एक्स एंड वाई आर नेगेटिव सो ऑर्डिनेट इज नेगेटिव दट इज वाई कोऑर्डिनेट इज नेगेटिव एंड द एच का वाई कोऑर्डिनेट इज कोऑर्डिनेट ऑफ एच आर माइनस फाइव माइनस थ्री सो ऑर्डिनेट ऑफ दिस कोऑर्डिनेट इज वाई लेस देन जीरो so ordinate of h is is equal to minus थ्री clear clear and सेवन question is the coordinates of point l सेवन is the coordinates of of point l and the coordinates of point f and eighth question is the coordinates of point m look at the figure coordinates of l l is in which quadrant l is on y axis and so x coordinate is zero So what are the coordinates of L? Zero five and M R minus three zero. Okay. So coordinates of L R coordinates of L R L is on y axis at a distance five in a positive direction of x axis. So coordinates of L R zero five and M is on x axis. So coordinates of point M R R minus three zero because it is in a negative direction of x axis at a distance three from origin. Okay, M is at a distance three from origin and in a negative direction of x axis. So y coordinate is zero. So coordinates of M are minus three zero and L is on y axis at a distance five in a positive direction of y axis. So whose x coordinate are zero and y coordinate is five. Okay. Coordinates of L are zero five and coordinates of M are minus three zero. Okay.